right, slightly different video today. I've got a little project I need to do. I've got vacuum cleaner head got delivered to replace the one that broke, or rather got jammed up with puddle of poo to cause toilet training. Anyway, uh, we sent them the model number, but they sent out 1 that doesn't fit at all. So, rather than rushing out and buying a whole new vacuum, quick trip to Bunnings. We've got some joiner hose and a couple of hose clamps. And all we're going to do and obviously because this doesn't fit and it's the wrong vacuum head. It doesn't even doesn't even have a chance of fitting, considering the vacuum doesn't even have little connectors. Can I show you there? It's just good old fashioned, straight onto the pipe. Bog stock standard vacuum cleaner pipe and a fancy head. Uh, so we're just gonna make it work. And all we're gonna do is jam that 25 mil, or closer to, an inch for you lot across the pond. And all I've done is jammed that on nice and tight. Then we're going to grab our ring clamp up under there. That'll be easier if I tighten that first. Force that around here. Now this little clip, obviously it's designed to clip onto whatever other attachment it's supposed to be. But we are just making do. So we'll go ahead and tighten that right down. I had thought maybe I'll have to do a bead of silicone inside there, but it's such a tight fit, I don't think it's going to matter. Clamp that down tight enough that it's going to seal and not just pull off. All right, now all we're going to do is drop our ring clamp under there and shorten that again and then just jam it in there. All I want to do now is Slide that all the way on there. That was so much easier now that I've um, warmed it up. Once that rubber cools, it's, um, well, it's not going anywhere. This clamp is just to make sure that it's not just going to pull off. The purpose in using the tube is, of course, to uh, maintain that vacuum seal along the pipe because what we've got here is the exact diameter on the attachment to the tube. Now, bear with me here peeps, get my fat hands out of the way. It's like a trade-off between being able to see what I'm doing and being able to show you what I'm doing. Which of course if I'm pointing at the camera then I can't see what, what I'm doing. Uh, but effectively, that's it. That's all we needed.